Hey loves, what's going on? This your girl back with another video. What's going on? What's going on? Um, I this is just a quick video. Um, I just wanted to come and show y'all today. I got out the house, me and my twins, me and my girls. Uh, we got out the house and uh made a grocery store run. We went to Walmart. Uh, cause we don't get out that much ever since this whole Corona situation, like we get out when we have to. Um, so yeah, we had to make a grocery store run. So I was just going and we went to the hair store cause, um, I'm going to end up doing a hair. I'll show y'all in a minute. But anyways, um, I just want to show y'all a couple things I picked up, um, at Walmart, a few items that we needed since I had to go anyways to Walmart. So First and foremost, I went and got a whole, uh, some candles. I got a lot of candles because I love candles, you guys. I'm sorry about that. But I absolutely love candles, y'all. Like, I got a whole, I'm going to show y'all. I got a whole uh, cabinet full of candles. Um, and I'm, like, real, real low. I'm getting real low because I usually just pick them up, like, randomly when I'm out shopping. But since I've been in the house and I've just been burning candles and not shopping, obviously, um, as the, the, the supply is real low. So I've picked up a few. I probably should have more, more than this, but whatever. So this one I got is called... Um, garden rain smells really good this one was like 790 something almost eight dollars and then i also got um this is the same brand main uh stays and this is hazelnut cream that smells super good too it's almost like a coffee like a hazelnut coffee creamer or something i got um apple cider donut yeah, this is a mainstay too, though. But this is a cheaper version because this one was like $6, I think. I don't know. I think this one was like $6 where the other ones are like almost 8 But you can tell the difference between the um, pack or the, the uh, jars that this one is a little more, you know, um, a little more expensive, a little more elegant, I guess. I don't know if you want to say it's not just like a plain jar like that. But um, these ones were like four something, I think. And this is a Cozy Gathering. Same brand, though. This one smells okay. I'm surprised. I must have just threw that one in a basket. It don't even smell that good. I mean, it's all right. But... Um, then I got these little ones. Same brand mainstays. I... They didn't have any of the more expensive ones on sale because sometimes a lot of times I will get the more expensive ones because these are like the cheaper ones, all the, the this particular brand, but um, they weren't on sale. So I just got some of the cheaper ones. Um, but this is Papaya pa Passion. These are 94 cent and then uh, Pineapple Lily. Yep. All these. Smells super good. I like them all so far, except for that one. Because I had my mask on when I was in the store, so I was trying to smell them through my mask because I didn't want to take my mask off. Do you guys, when y'all go out, y'all wear y'all mask and gloves? Some people would trip me out because they'd be in a store with their mask on, but I have it pulled down where their nose is exposed. It's like you're not even protected. Like, it just doesn't make sense. You might as well not even have on a mask. But I didn't want to take my mask off, so I was trying to smell it through the mask. I think that's how I end up getting that one that don't smell that good. But all the rest of them smell pretty good. This is vanilla. Another 94 cent one. Um, and the last one is aqua crystals. This one smells super good too. So I got that. I got, of course, some food and stuff like that. And then I got had to give me some wine, y'all. I have never had this. This is Bella um bole bella bole moscato peach moscato i'm about to crack this open in a minute taste this um i got that one and then of course i had to get me some stella rose black um i love the stella rose black stella rose period is good but black is good and i like this one because it's not a corkscrew it's just a uh, twist um bottle like the core screws are fine especially like special occasion but half the time i'll be losing my um cork screw opener so i don't be having i don't have time to search for it like when i'm ready for a glass of wine i just want to twist that top i don't want to have to worry about 
finding a corkscrew or a bottle opener. So um, that's why I like the black. I know some of the other Stella Rose bottles do have the corkscrew on it. And like I said, I do have a corkscrew, but I don't know. It'd be lost in my uh, silverware drawer. So I just, you know. I prefer the twist bottle just in case I can't find the corkscrew. Anyways, um, so I got that. And then, like I said, I was going to do my girl's hair. At first, um, it, I was going to have a good friend of ours uh, do their hair um, because I know she doesn't go out and she's not exposed and around a lot of people. Like, she actually takes things seriously. But she is a um, cosmetologist and she does hair. Um and she really hasn't been doing hair recently just because of everything going on. She's just now starting to get back into it. So that's why I was like, well, I'll just have them. I'll just, you know, have her do their hair. But I think I might do it myself because I'm still a little leery about going around people without masks and just being around people in a closed environment for long periods of time. And like I said, my, I got twins, so that's two heads that she would have to do. And they're getting the crochet uh, passion twist. And I know how to do crochet, but usually I never do their hair. We always just go to people and get our hair done because usually I don't have the time to do, I just don't have the time. It's easy for me to take them to the salon or drop them off and get their hair done, go back and pick them up, you know. But now since I'm not working, I was kind of thinking about it like, I could really do their hair myself. So I think I might just do it myself, but this is um, the hair that I got from the hair store um yeah so i don't know can y'all see that brand it's magic gold and it's the 18 inch uh passion lock braid so i think i'm gonna do it and if i end up doing it myself which nine times out of ten i probably am the more that i think about it i'm gonna record myself doing it so you guys can see um some of my older videos if you go back and look i had did my oldest daughter's hair in um a vixen sew-in like so long ago um, so I know how to do hair, you know, I'm not a professional. I just do hair on myself and my kids. Um, and I really haven't been doing that in a long time just because it's just easier for us to go and get it done by a professional, but I know what I'm doing enough so it can look good. And, um, so I think I'm going to do it hair myself. But like I said, if I end up doing that, I will definitely do, um, a video on that but like I said I just kind of wanted to come show you guys um and say I got out the house today <laughs> because I don't get out the house much how are you guys doing are you have you guys been getting out because I know people that I know personally is not really taking everything as serious as as, as they should and they actually you know, they go out and be around people and not wearing gloves, you know, and stuff. For the most part, like when I'm in the store, when I was in the store, um, or when I do go to the store for um, essential needs, um, a lot of people do have their masks and gloves on, but a lot of people do, I see, like not having their mask on all the way. But so I just thought I would record a quick video since I actually got out the house today. And, um,. Yeah, so, but I, oh, I do want to show y'all my, like, my candle cabinet and how bare it is. So, let me show y'all real quick. But it is so, so bare, y'all. I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to turn this way because, <clears throat> look at this. It's a lot of candles in here, but a lot of them are, like, partially, mostly used. And what I'm going to do is melt these down. And next time I go get out, I'm going to get some candle wicks. So I can melt them. I'm going to combine them all. So if there are any scents in here that's uh, similar, I'm going to melt them all down and make like a big candle. Um, however many jars I can fill up. So anything like fruity like this, I'll do with other fruity scents. Anything that's like vanilla, I'll do with any other, other scent that is um, vanilla. So that's why I keep these and don't throw them away because I can melt these down and make a full jar with so many you know use jars you know so because i have so many in here i have a lot of these left these burners i need to start using these because i haven't really been using them i need to straighten this up but this is like nothing you guys this is horrible this is like bare compared to what i usually have and if i would was getting out and shopping how i normally would um this wouldn't look like this this would be very well plenished and um full and i would have a whole lot more a uh, larger quantity larger stock of candles but you know with that being said 
this gives me time to do what I said I was gonna do. That's why I keep these and I just never have the time to kind of all melt them down together. But now that I have time, I'm gonna take a day and do that. And I probably will do a video on that too and show you guys um, how I do that as well once I end up doing that. Um, but yeah, so I love candles. So like I said, I have a whole closet of candles, a whole whatever, you know, cabinet of candles. So anyway sorry guys so yeah but i just wanted to show you guys that and um yeah that's about it so i'm gonna end this video thanks for stopping, stopping by my channel you guys please rate comment and subscribe please support me it will keep me consistent bringing content uploading videos i have a lot of um different ideas and different things that um i want to bring to you guys so just make sure you you know be supportive and things like that so um i think that's it yeah that's it rate comment subscribe bye loves deuces